Hey guys, welcome to my channel and in today's video I'm going to use this impact wrench with a 70mm socket. So I have something shiny in my hand here and these are wheel lock bolts. I'm going to read what this bag says. Titanium cone seat wheel bolt 12 by 1.5 by 45 millimeter so in today's video i'm going to install these shiny wheel bolts i'm going to get rid of these factory steel bolts and i'm going to install these they are titanium just like a red of the bag well they are titanium so there is the difference right here so this is something regular that 99 percent of cars have the reason that i'm going to install these is because I came across a set of titanium wheel bolts that was a 50% off. So the reason for this price reduction was that these were 45 millimeter bolts. What we have on our cars is about 30 millimeters or so. You cannot really use 45 millimeter long bolts on the rear of these cars. If these bolts are way too long, they will run into parking brake components. So what you can realistically use in place of the factory bolts without spacers is uh, about 5 millimeters longer bolts. 45 is way too long. So I cut these down because that's what I figured. I can buy these bolts. I don't care if they're 45 millimeters long because I can cut them down. They're 50% off. That's half the price. I would never, probably never, I would never pay a uh, full price on, on, uh, on, on log bolts. This is the 45 and this is the uh, cut down version so you can actually see uh, the difference in the length so my car is out of gear so if i put this 45 millimeter bolt in so at some point at some point there you go so the bolt is not a hundred percent in but it's already locking up so this bolt is uh is 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 it's basically too long so if, if you have 20 millimeter spacers then yeah you can you can use you have to use longer bolts the reason i still have this 45 millimeter bolt i only cut 10 of them down because cutting titanium is a is a is a challenge that is a, is is actually a difficult task but on our cars on e90 chassis on the front, you can use a 45 millimeter long bolt without any spacers. There is nothing behind, and I can demonstrate that too. So a good thing I have this assembly here. So I'm, I'm going to demonstrate what it's like. Here is a here is a factory long bolt. So it runs in. Uh, by the way, this is all M3 parts. So if I stick this bolt in, where it approximately goes, it's uh, it's slightly out on, on the other side. And that's how much of a wheel actually we have uh, uh, the flange of the wheel and if you have a and if you have a longer bolt I might cut them down at some point but I don't have to and having a set well 10 45 millimeter bolts is uh, well who knows but maybe at some point in the future I might want to uh, use them for something but here's a 45 millimeter bolt without being cut so it's, it protrudes on the back side of the hub this much, that's like almost 20 millimeters, but there's nothing on the back side to really, for this bolt to run into. So this is just a, well, yeah, it's kind of ugly, but no one is going to know. Well, by the way, you still have a brake roller here and a wheel. So it, it's not going to run into anything. So it is okay or safe to use a 45 millimeter long bolt on the front but that's on with the front and now let's get uh, these cut down version bolts in so there you go it's not running into anything and now we're going to uh, basically just remove all of these and I'm going to put these four back in. And that's pretty much it. Ta-da! Looks pretty good, I guess. Shiny. Now I have to torque it 
And that should be it, I guess, for this video. My car is rolling. I good thing my garage floor is flat. And my car didn't roll away. And a bonus material in this video. A really small touch. I'm going to install these valve caps. They are like this. Original BMW. And these are the anniversary anniversary edition. Really cool stuff, I guess. So guys, I think that should be it for this video. Here is my titanium wheel bolts. Like I said, they are shiny. Uh, my wheels are not. The only thing that is left here is uh, the center cap. I still have the uh, Apex original. I think I should go with the BMW ones. So this should be it for now. Thanks for watching my channel. Thanks for watching my videos. Thumbs up, thumbs down, subscribe, like, dislike, leave some comments. See you next time.